Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Ultima 9 Ascension, and when last we left off we got some terrifying news from Lord British. His astronomers have indeed confirmed what we read about previously, that the moons of Britannia are slowly being drawn closer to the planet. If they collide with the planet, all life will be destroyed, and we certainly don't want that, so let's hurry on to you, shall we? Lord British has opened up the way to you. It's through that cave, past this archway, near the area where we went up to deal with those thieves on the way to pause. And there is a goblin right here that is waiting to have at thee with us. Or maybe this goblin is not going to have at thee with us. Oh, you are! And you are gone. You managed to get one hit, but that one hit really isn't going to do very much. I was kind of hoping that you would just not attack me, considering the fact that you hadn't uh, rushed at me immediately, but we just hadn't got within your aggro radius. Now, we're not going to go into that shack, because that person will try and hit us. Instead, we are going to carry on to where we need to go, over to here, where there should now be... Remember there was a, uh, plaque that said that this was, uh... Hello! You, uh, you caught me off guard there by not being animated. Well played! The, uh, plaque here is gone because this bit of wall is gone, so let us now go through this cave of goblins. And see just what foes await us. Well... The first foe is a spider. That's quite uh, predictable, considering the fact that uh, there are spider webs about. We can go one way or another way. Let's go this way first. If this is the way we need to go for progress, we will backtrack. Now, we're going to have to jump up to here. This cave certainly has seen better days. Also, that is... Uh, Everything shaking because of a very big enemy, and that is a very big spider that we took out in one single hit. That also gave us some spider silk. Hmm, this place is very dark. If you don't mind, I'm going to go the other way first and see if there is anything there. That seems like the way to progress. It also seems like the way to, uh, doom and gloom, quite literally. Hmm, can we climb up here? Yes, we can. Okay. Up here is... Another... Ooh, another giant spider. Who's going to poison us? Ooh, and hit a lot for some damage. Ooh, man, that was a lot of hurt. But we have the ability to heal ourselves, so it doesn't really bother us too much. And the uh, poison damage is actually quite minimal. Carefully does it. Anything in here? No. There's an explosive barrel there. There's a normal barrel here. And nothing in those. Okay. Here we go. Hello. You're going to do that, which means that we'll get hit again. And take some more damage. Quite a quite a bit of damage. Oh, oh. That that actually hurt a lot. That, that hurt a lot, to the point that I'm actually going to get the Cure spell ready. Let's, uh, let's put that on F7, shall we? Get all of that, uh, health back, and then do a bit of healing. Getting the, uh, extra intelligence for more mana, definitely worth it for this part. Now, smash these open. See if there's anything cool in these. The answer is no. And there's goodies here, though. Mimic? Nope, just goodies. In here is a... a pumpkin and some oranges. Okay, not exactly the best goodies. In here... some gold. Not bad. Is that all there was in here? Yep, that's all there was. What about over here? Okay, more webs. A lot of loot in here. A lot of loot. I get the feeling that's a mimic. I get the feeling that one might be a mimic. I mean, call it a hunch. I, I just 
have a feeling that that one might be a mimic. I'm going to, uh, by the way, activate a light spell so that I can see in here. And try and open this one. Oh, what a surprise! It's a mimic! It's a mimic! Who'd have thought it? Are you actually going to... No, you're going to get to me. I'm just going to hit you a few times. At the very least, try to. You're actually... really capable of, uh, dealing a lot of damage. And you are gone. That's... that's good news. That's good news. Now, in here... some gold and a gem. Which is good. How many of the other ones are going to be, uh, mimics, however? Let's find out. This one is not a mimic. Good. Uh, this one? Also not a mimic. Also, it contains, by the looks of it, some reagents. Purple potions, green potions... Green potions are not good. We don't want them. Oh! Hi. Uh, I think I'm just gonna go. Uh, have fun. Nothing more I need to do here. I, I think I've got everything. Yeah, yeah, I've got everything. Also, before I leave, you're going to take a long time to get to me anyway. We'll eat some pumpkins. And a carrot or two. Marvellous. One uh, bit of healing via a potion. And a bit of uh, healing via that. And we're good. Still chasing me, I presume? Nope, you've given up. Great. We'll leave uh, you for the next adventurer to stumble into. I'm sure they'll be able to take care of you much more capably. So... That was some treasure. There were some potions there I, I could have gone and uh, grabbed, but I probably don't need them. Not right now, anyway. We'll go the other way. The other way, full of darkness, gloom, and probably more spiders. And mimics! Is that a spider that's... that's a small spider. I can deal with a small one. No money? No money. Right. There's a lot of dark, windy passageways here. And I'm not going to be happy if my torch runs out any time soon, or rather my, uh, light spell. Nothing in here. Oh! Brings me back to here. Well, going, uh, the long way round was kind of pointless. Ah, well. Never mind. We'll go this way instead. Climb up here. And how about thee with you, tiny spider? You are gone. Brilliant. Now, I think we found where we need to be. We're out. And it looks like combat's happened here. We have, uh, a mace. Ah! And you. You are a rather well-equipped opponent. There are two of you. Hmm. You're going to move forward. Yes, you are. Have at thee! I have a pretty good weapon here. Oh, oh, this weapon is going to save me a lot of, uh, trouble. Because... You also had 200 gold. That, uh, that foe is tough. And you would be tough if the other foe had been there as well, but they weren't. So let's follow this, uh, handy sign that points me to you. Not you, uh, the place called you. You know what I mean. You appear to be doing something. Well, what you're not going to be doing is, uh having at thee with me, because I am very much prepared for all of you. Hello! I'm the Avatar. Nice to meet you. You really don't want to just say hi, do you? You just want to try and kill me. Oh, okay, that's fine. You can try. You'll fail, but you can try. Also, big area full of spiders there. Okay, big area full of spiders. I'm just gonna explore around and see if I can find anything neat. Like here. There might be goodies. I like getting goodies. I also like getting gold, because we're going to need a lot of it. 
So what is up here that makes exploring in this direction worth it? There is a tree. LM and MC. Does pressing this do anything? Nope. It's just uh, somebody who decided to uh, engrave something on that tree. Alex and Michael. Rest well. In loving memory of Phyllis Jones. You are my muse. I am your legacy. Oh, we found a uh, a grave and memorial. This place is so peaceful and serene. We should take a moment, Avatar, and sit down. If you can actually manage it. That is not what I intended, Avatar, but... It's gonna have to do, isn't it? Yes, it is. I think we're done here, though. Behind is nothing. As I thought there would be nothing, but, uh... Worth checking. Now, there's an area full of spiders. As you can imagine, I'm not thrilled at the prospect of going through an area full of spiders, especially considering that some of those spiders are rather big and nasty. But there's probably treasure. And I want treasure. Now, how many spiders are there? There are some very, very big ones. Okay, big spiders. I get the jump on you, like so, you can't do anything. And that's what I'm counting on. And you? You didn't decide to fire a web like the other ones did. Well, I'm not going to say no to uh, an easy fight there and money. There's a rat. There's at least uh, one. No, there's just one. It was just making lots and lots of noise because it couldn't pathfind its way to me. Ah, well. Grab this. Is there something up here that I want? There's a rat! Okay. You're gone. And, ooh. There's an arrow that points to something else by the looks of it. Where's the gold? There's the gold! I want that. This arrow points to... something. Okay! Hmm. That looks ominous. I get the feeling I shouldn't be here right now. But you know what? We're here, so let's have a look. That looks like a hellhound. They look like uh, they're not going to be happy to see me. They're not! Fortunately, they're rather easy to take care of with this ridiculously powerful sword. I really wonder what's here that makes exploring off the beaten path worth it, because this is certainly an area that screams hidden goodies and treasure. Okay, reagents, sulfurous ash, that makes sense. We're in an area full of burning and lava. And over there looks to be... nothing. Ah! A column! That hurt a little. So I think we need to come here relatively soon. Oh, hello, there's another one! How about they? And you're gone too. Won't say no to these uh, rubies, they are worth a little bit. We'll say no, however, to the ability to... Oh, that actually hurts me. Okay, your remains hurt me. Now let's grab this. If I can. Game. I, I like the ruby. There we go. Thank you. And we'll keep looking about. I, I really feel like I'm, I'm going a little too far ahead. Hmm. I won't say no to, uh, having a look about. I've found something. 
Oh, hello. Okay, that will just hit me regardless. Sometimes you don't drop a, uh... Ruby. Okay, there's a bunch of reagents there I don't need. There's a cave here, probably full of peril. Or it could be the way towards the dungeon. Nope, it's just full of hellhounds. Okay. How about... Ow. How about thee? And you're gone. Right, grab this gold. Anything else in here apart from fire and trouble? Nope, nothing in here apart from fire and trouble. Lots of lava. That makes sense. What with the whole, uh... Ash and, uh, flame motif. There's something bad there. Yep, that, that's all kinds of bad. Let's get over to you. Ow. That will hit me regardless of, uh, where it hits I'm, uh, discovering. Hmm. Those look like dangerous foes. I'm gonna heal. This does mean that my, uh, torch is going to fade away at some point, but... Yeah, they look like zombies. Zombies I can probably take care of. How about they? Yup. Definitely can take care of zombies. Kind of. So they break into pieces. Not the hardest foes. You did drop something, though. That is a... A rotten cabbage. Not really in any need for that. And there's another rotten cabbage. These enemies sure do love giving me rotten cabbages, don't they? In here is a... A Ring of Fire scroll. Okay. I mean, I'm not going to need this for a while, but... But, also not going to say no to a Ring of Fire scroll. That seems like it might open. But it won't. Okay, if there's a puzzle there, I have yet to figure it out. Let's go over here. Is that a... Is that a dragon? Oh! Hi! Hmm... Methinks I should not be fighting you right now. I mean, I'm dealing damage. Okay, you're dead. And there's you. Quickly take care of you while you're distracted. How much gold is this? 400! Okay, let's go. I don't know why I'm heading forward here. This this really seems like uh, I should not be here. But then again, I'm equipped with a really powerful weapon. More hellhounds? Please don't fire fire at me. Yep, there's that fire that I can't... Okay, that actually didn't... There's a brigand up here! A brigand? Really not the kind of foe you'd expect to find here. How are you doing? You are really out of your depth, sir. Case in point, I'm just going to hit you once, probably. No, you take a few hits, but but now you're gone. Ah, uh, that would be the entrance into the dungeon, but I can't access it. Makes sense. Volcanic eruptions will do that. Whatever place this used to be is uh very much gone. Very much gone. Another one of them. Going to still avoid that. And the avatar just hums while, uh, 
exploring the ruins of... Ooh, is that cheese? I'm not going to say no to ruin cheese. Mmm, delicious. The avatar is just humming idly while looking about. This place looks like it's been uh, ruined for quite a long time. And I'm curious as to if I can rest on that bed. If I can rest on that bed, I can get all of my uh, mana back. No, no I can't. Darn it. Ah, well. I think we are approaching the end of this uh, area, though. Oh, hi! Hello. You're gone. Let's uh, just grab this and uh, move away. You're going to move away there. Mm, I think that uh, whatever I need to do here is something I haven't figured out yet, but still a nice place to uh, examine. Got some really nice uh, treasure. Really nice treasure. Case in point, uh, another ruby. I'll be making a fair amount of cash once I uh, head back to Britain. There may even be somewhere in you that I can sell these rubies, though I'm not going to count on it. I'm also uh, not confident that enemies won't have uh, respawned behind me. Yep, enemies have respawned behind me. Hurrah! There were no hurrahs. There will, however, be more rubies. And thus, there was a limitless supply of gems in Britannia, and the gem market collapsed, as it predictably would. Another grave down there. Those reagents are actually floating in the air. Okay. And another ruby. Sure. That must have been dropped by the zombie. Let's just get out of here and make our way back to uh, the direction where you is as quickly as possible, because this place it's not... Ooh, is that another ruby? Yep, another ruby. We could just pop back to Britain and sell all of these, because I uh, quite literally have a full inventory of them. A full inventory of gems. Do we have the ability to put any of these away? I mean, we can put this down now. That's, uh, skeleton is not going to be coming back. Also, more cake. I will eat that cake. Just to restore a little bit of health. And make our way back down. No more... Nope, no more hellhounds. That's fine. I'm actually quite glad there are no more hellhounds. If only that sign actually told me what was over here. Oh, it will if I go to this one. Okay, if I go to this one, it'll tell me that this is the way to... Really? Really? That doesn't seem good. And so, when we come back, folks, if that is you, there's really nothing left of it. Hopefully this person on the road will be able, and there goes my uh, light spell, to give me some more details, because uh, I'm sceptical. Maybe they've made a new town over here. That is definitely the hope. And so, I'll catch you next time, folks, and I'll see you then. Later. I really hope that's not you. I really hope that's not you.